G'day guys, Asma here, and welcome back to Satisfactory. So, I've done a little bit of work in between episodes, and I've moved the hub over here. And, yeah, so it used to be just over there where the cursor is. Actually, what's over there? Yeah, one concrete. Oh. And, yeah, so now everything's here. I've moved things around, make things look a little bit better. So we've got our burners over here, our fuel, you know, our power, for now. So our copper goes along here into here, and then gets split up into these three um, smelters. And then obviously gets, it gets put into all these, and it gets taken up upstairs into these two containers here um, then the concrete comes from the limestone over there comes right along here goes up there and goes into that one there and then the iron just quickly before we try to do what we've got to do today the iron comes from over there into here gets split up into all this and then gets put up stairs into these two things here anyway I'll see you guys in just a little bit and we'll get going to, on our little plan today alright so what our plan today is to try to get an assembler going but I may have buggered this up already Yeah, um... Actually, you know what? What we'll do... We'll take all that out of here... And put it all into... Hang on, hang on. Take it out of there. We'll sort that out. And put it all into here. Then, okay, so... I'm thinking what we'll do just to try this out we'll get an assembler right there and so just so we can put it put this somewhere what do we need we need we need rods all right so there we go There we go. Now, this is just to test this whole system out. Um, so what we want to do is... I don't know if this is going to work, but we'll try it. Maybe, maybe... Alright, so to kind of... There we go. Okay, so we've got this thing gonna make that uh, power wise that by right should go into there hmm you know what we'll just go put this thing in here no power. Why you got no power? Hmm. 
There we go. Let's go have a look why we've got no power. We've got like no power everywhere. Yeah, we've got no power everywhere. Alright. Did I kill the power? No. We've got no fuel. Alright, so. So this is our little fuel st uh, making station. Um, there we go. So that had this one has too much power. Now that one, I'm pretty sure, is the one that we just did because yeah, because it goes to that one. Yep. So by putting this on, there we go. We might just have to, oh actually, you know what? Um, we can make, th we can make things look pretty in a minute. We can use one of the burner fuel thingamabobs on here. Um, we need to go get some biofuel though. Nothing in there. There we go. Now let's see if this actually works. <sighs> It'll work for now. It saves us having to manually make these little rotor things, these things here. Look how fancy that is. Okay, so we'll let that do its thing. Make our rotors for our jump pads. Um, let's have a little bit of a... Actually, you know what? Let's go have a bit of a play with... Uh, Mr... Chainsaw here. <laughs> yeah, I didn't keep any fuel for it. Whoops, my bad. Yeah, once we get this all, like, this idea over here working, what I might do is put the assembly and all that upper level in line with these. Mm. We'll see. What else can we actually make here? Oh, reinforced plates. That'd be nice. And smart plating. Ooh. Alright. There's, there's actually a bit in there to do. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna select our biomass. There we go. Now that's gonna make some biomass for us. Now. Oh, I'm gonna have a look around. Figure out what we're gonna do. And then I'm gonna come back to you guys. Instead of me aimlessly running around on camera, I'll do that and then I'll come back and we'll figure this out.
Alright, so we're going to go ahead and put our things in here ready to go. There we go, so we just need the rotors. Now, do I have anything in here? Alien organs. Well, they can go in there too. There we go. Alright. Just waiting for the rotors. Okay, so we're out here doing a little bit of exploration. Uh, you're protecting something, aren't you, mate? Let's come and take it off you. Ha ha ha! Oh, glowworm thingy. What are you? Power slug. Alright. We'll take you. This okay, so slug seems to emit unfamiliar energy readings, which could potentially be retrofitted into Fixit technology. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Okay, so I think if we can find everything over here, I'm going to move over here. We'll leave that factory over there. Let it do its thing. What will make a factory over here? Because I'm sure at one point in time we're going to need water, right? Okay, that's an interesting ore. Okay. Okay, what is that up there? What are you? What are you? Ow! Stay down. Seems fancy. Yeah. Oh. Oh, hello. So, I think we've found a possible new area uh, that we can we can live in. What are these over here? Ah, oh, it takes so long to run. Come on! Come on! I heard you. Come on. You coming or what? So you're oh you're a pure iron, okay. Silly thing. Oh, that's copper. Oh, nice. Stay down. Okay, we've got copper and... Ooh, co yeah, copper and iron right next to each other. We may have a new spot, guys. We may have a new spot. Okay. Ah! <laughs> okay, let's grab these things. So these are um, bit of food, bit of health. All right, so hold E. Might as well grab this thing. S summer sloop. Okay. 
Oh, isn't that beautiful? Oh, ooh, look at this flat area over here. Every freaking time. You, yeah, just run away. Thank you. <laughs> What's this one? That's iron as well. Is there a... If we have a concrete one down here, that would be awesome. Somewhere. What about over here? Whoop. This would be a nice little area, wouldn't it? Is there anything over here? Oh, that's always good to have a bit of... Not this time, mate. <laughs> Ah, yes, this looks like concrete now, doesn't it? Limestone. Nice! Yeah, we'll move over here. That's our goal for the next few episodes, I think. What we'll do is we'll just leave the one that we've got at the moment. Are you stuck? Oh. Ha ha ha! I can't go get this thing again. <sighs> okay. Now we should. The rotors should be done, so. This is pretty. Alright. I'll see you guys in a little bit here, we'll get back to base and we will uh, decide what we're going to do to get over here. Alright, so we're back, we're back. Um, I've got 23, Jesus. It's going to take a while. Obviously not the way we're meant to do it, we're meant to be able to feed both of them in there, but I play fucked up. <laughs> you know, silly me forgot that we had water here. I wonder how deep that would have to be. You never know, huh? You reckon this is deep enough? We just wait on the last few rotors. <laughs> oh! Stupid little motherfucker. Yeah. We actually have it pretty nice over here. Not gonna lie, we don't even have to move. Okay, well this is a new little, uh... Huh. I don't think I'm meant to be zapping that. Oh well. There's definitely plenty of wood. Hmm. There's definitely a big chunk of water. Oh, look at that. I wonder if we can get down there. Without freaking hurting ourselves. This might be a spot. I wonder I wonder what that is. Looks like it's iron or something, but this would be like a nice little um 
bay for a little factory. You got your water. You put the whatever the hell that bloody mine thing is. I think it's iron. Um. Hmm. A waterfall over there. Hmm. Yeah, um, it's a nice map. La di da, la di da. <laughs> bit more bloody challenging but we got it but now we can go figure out what this all over here is oh coal well that's that, that's got to be important uh, oh yeah time to look down there <laughs> ah! Radio. Uh, well, that's one way to get back to base. Ha 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 ha! I win. Uh, I've never noticed that. Oh, I don't win because I got to go get me stuff now. Oh well. I'll see you guys once you get back. Alright, so swimming back. I've died again. <laughs> swimming back through the second time though. I found this. What the hell is it? What's well, a drop pod? Alright. Uh, it's in the middle of the water. Alright. Well, we'll have to figure out how to do that. But that can be an adventure for another day. Okay, so we're running back to our factory. And I found this one. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, so just to give some... Like... Uh, coordination, I guess. There's the drop pod thing. And uh, whatever that thing is, it's over there. It's not, not too far away. And our base is over this way. You can see our little thing over there. Alright. Let's go get our rotors and we'll continue on our little journey here. We might knock this out, get this out of the way now too. And build it upstairs, I don't know yet. Um. I've got no more screws there, so you know what. Let's just, um... Let's just get rid of the power line for now. Alright. Milestone reached. Several Let's watch this go. Aimed at factory traversal can now be accessed in the build menu. Caution is recommended during use of these products. Yeah. Bye bye. Okay, let's look at our next um, milestone. Oh, it's that. That's it. All right. Now, we have to make a space elevator or something, I think. Yeah, this thing. Ooh, we need a lot. Okay. 
Actually, we might have enough. You know what? Let's go have a look. Can we, um... Can we... How do you add that to the thing above? There we go. And we'll just chuck it here. I reckon. Yeah, as I said, that was that's too easy, and this will be too easy. Uh, iron plates, which is in this one, and iron rods. There we go. My dear, how big is it? Oh. Oh. Okay, so it's 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 kind of big. <laughs> what, the, what the hell do you do with this thing? It's fucking huge. Okay, we gotta find. There's not. Ah, oh, let's go get it. We gotta find a spot for this fucking thing to go. Don't even know how to use this thing, but it'll do. Ha <laughs> ha! Got you this time. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea where to put this body thing. <laughs> what about over here? There we go. Oh, look at that. Okay, so what the hell does this thing even do? So I'm guessing we gotta make 50 of those. Okay. That's, 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 that's awesome. <laughs> okay, so I think our next objective after we, we'll do our, um, our milestone. And then our objective is to get that, um, thing what it wants. Bloody hell. That's fucking huge. Oh, well, let's go have a look. See what we need for this milestone. Eh, eh, eh. Okay, so what do you want? You want 200 plates, you want 177 of those. Those, we need a uh, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And 500 of those. Alright. By rights, we've got, we've got this covered.
Milestone reached. You have been given early access to the anti-waste effort for stress testing of materials on Exoplanet's bonus program. Following parts into the awesome resource sink, depending on their amount and complexity, will grant you coupons in the awesome store, which can be exchanged for bonus rewards. Examples of bonus content are parts, walls, factory attachments, and cosmetics. Fixit is working hard to develop additional options, which will be added to the awesome store in the future. Go that extra kilometer. Go awesome. <laughs> All right. Okay. This thing is going to be pretty cool. Alright, the next thing is that. But, we might do that in the next episode, guys. I think this episode is long enough. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I know we didn't get a lot done, but... I mean, look at that. We got that done. <laughs> oh, boy. That's... That. That's, that's just bloody crazy. Hmm. Now, I, I, actually, before we actually end this episode, let's go have a look at this thing, because I thought I saw... These things, like these things over here, are these shoots to go into it or something? Or... Ooh, it, oh, they are, look at that. That's pretty cool. Oh, you can climb up on it. Ha <laughs> ha Short lived. Yeah, but yeah, look at that. All, all the conveyor belts. Are they going in? Yeah, they're going in. Look at that. Oh, that's pretty cool. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, I'd appreciate it if you hit that thumbs up button. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing as we do upload daily at 2 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. And on that note, guys, I'll see you tomorrow.